Hello, Paso, and welcome to Fact Friday. I'm Martin Padilla. The Environmental Services Department will be hosting a citywide cleanup event where roll off dumpsters will be placed at various locations throughout the city. Here to tell us more about that is Sarah Ortiz. Sarah, thank you so much for joining us. For those that don't know, what is the ESD Neighborhood Cleanup Event? The ESD Neighborhood Cleanup Event is a citywide event that will provide the public with the opportunity to do some summer cleaning, which will hopefully reduce illegal dumping, educate the public on proper waste management practices, and help beautify our wonderful city. When will the cleanup take place? The cleanup is scheduled to begin in mid-July. For updates, we recommend contacting our ESD outreach team by phone at 915-212-6006 or by email at esdoutreach at elpasotexas.gov to be added to our event registration list. How many locations per district? The ESD Neighborhood Cleanup is an eight-week event in which we plan to target one district per Saturday. Those added to our event registration list will receive updates on specific locations. Which items are acceptable and which are unacceptable? Some of the prohibited items are household hazard chemicals such as paint, oil, cleaning fluids, and pesticides. In addition, tires and e-waste such as televisions, computers, and other electronics will not be accepted in the roll-offs. Where can items that are not acceptable be disposed? Most items can be disposed of at one of ESD's five citizen collection stations. For more information on location and also for a full list of accepted items, please visit ESD's website. Can residents volunteer? Of course, the Neighborhood Cleanup is a community-led event where volunteers are essential. We highly encourage the public to be added to our registration list for more updates. Where can people find more information? For more information, please contact our ESD outreach team at 915-212-6006 or by email at esdoutreach at elpasotexas.gov. Is there anything else you'd like to add? We look forward to hosting this event and appreciate all those who are volunteering. However, if you cannot attend, no worries. We want to remind the public that they can dispose of unwanted household items year-long at our citizen collection stations, which are located throughout the entire city. Well, that does it on this edition of Fact Friday. Sarah, thank you so much for joining us, and thank you all for watching. For more information or if you want to volunteer, make sure to contact the ESD Outreach Team. We'll see you all on the next Fact Friday.